the care of someone having a heart attack begins in the ambulance and in the field. It then migrates to the emergency room. From the emergency room, the care is quickly transitioned to the cath lab. So the earlier we can identify someone as having a heart attack, the earlier we can get them to the cath lab and get their artery open. Now getting the artery open is known as angioplasty and stenting. It is critical to do that procedure and get the artery open as quickly as possible. Stent is a little mesh-like structure which you can go in and through a device we can deploy that inside the artery and open the blockage up. It's permanent, it stays there, um, it has a very, very small chance of blocking back up and if so we can always go back and open it up again. The procedure itself is used in multiple scenarios. It's used when patients present with uh, a heart attack, when an artery is completely shut down, the blood is uh, not getting to the muscle and they are in dire need of uh, restoring that blood flow. If that doesn't happen timely, then the patients can suffer some long-term consequences. Uh, and certainly it's a major risk factor for, uh, for uh, uh, adverse events such as dying from, from a heart attack. So it becomes very, very important to take care of those patients very urgently, very quickly. The national benchmark is 90 minutes from the time someone gets to the door of the emergency room to the time the artery is open. Now here at Tanner, we strive for better than that. Our average is less than 60 minutes. So we know the importance of actually getting in, getting the artery open quickly. We know that also translates into our patients doing better after their heart attacks. Tanner's advancing health with heart care beyond measure.